Thank you, Mr. Chair. Mr. Chairman, honorable members of the Commission on Appointments, ladies and gentlemen, this representation as chairperson of the Committee on Foreign Affairs has the distinct privilege to sponsor the nominations and ad interim appointments of eight officials of the Department of Foreign Affairs. Your committee found our nominees and appointees to be fit and qualified and ruled to endorse them to the plenary for the approval of this August body. Following this morning's public hearing and deliberations on their qualifications and credentials as career officers from the Department of Foreign Affairs. Distinguished colleagues, I respectfully recommend that this body give its consent to the nominations of two ambassadors, namely, number one, Florida Ann Camille Puzon Mayo, Chief of Mission Class Two, as Ambassador Extraordinary and Plenipotentiary to the Kingdom of Cambodia. Tata, as she is fondly called by her staff, is presently the Consul General of the Philippine Consulate General in Chongqing, People's Republic of China, since May 2021. She assumed important posts in the Home Office and Overseas Posts as Minister and Consul in Philippine Embassy in Ottawa, Canada, Second Secretary and Consul in Philippine Embassy in Oslo, Norway, Second Secretary and Consul in Philippine Embassy in Stockholm, Sweden, and Vice Consul in Philippine Consulate General in Hong Kong. She is also knowledgeable in basic French, Mandarin, Bahasa Indonesia, Nihongo, and Swedish languages, and was conferred with Gawad Mabini with the rank of Commander Dakila Kasugo in the year 2010. Next month, she will be celebrating her, her 42nd year in the Department of Foreign Affairs, having joined the department in April of 1982. Number two, Edgar Thomas Quilino Oxilian, Chief of Mission Class Two, as Ambassador Extraordinary and Plenipotentiary to the Independent State of Papua New Guinea, with concurrent jurisdiction over the Republic of Kiribati and Solomon Islands. Born in Anini, Anini Antique, our nominee is currently the Consul General in Philippine Consulate General in Jeddah, Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. In his 27 years in the Foreign Service, he has proven to be a reliable officer in the DFA head office and overseas posts as Minister and Consul General and Deputy Permanent Representative to the United Nations Environment Program and the United, St United Nations Habitat in Nairobi, Kenya from 2019 to 2021. As Consul in the Philippine Consulate General in Agana, Guam, USA from 2011 to 2017. And as Second Secretary, Consul and Officer in Charge in Philippine Embassy Extension Office in Bonn, Germany. The Commission on Appointments confirmed his ad interim appointment to the rank of Chief of Mission Class II last February 2023. He is hoping to secure the nod of this esteemed body once again this time as ambassador to Papua New Guinea, prob probably as a birthday gift as he just turned 60 last Thursday, March 7. Likewise, dear colleagues, Mr. Chair, I recommend that this body confirm the ad interim appointment and promotion of the following young and promising diplomats. Number one, Stacy Danica Alcantara Garcia to the rank of Foreign Service Officer Class Two. Bodger Bada Kapati to the rank of Foreign Service, Service Officer Class Two, Edward the Gublo Chan to the rank of Foreign Service Officer Class Two, Maria Cristina Cecilia Caballero Hernandez to the rank of Foreign Service Officer Class Two, Jake Robin Sukgang Ramintas to the rank of Foreign Service Officer Class Two, and finally Jomar Tomorong Sadi the rank of Foreign Service Officer Class 2. That is all, Mr. Chairman. I so move, Mr. Chair. Thank you very much.